In order to make the app installable, there are a few criteria, and we also fulfill these criteria. We have created the web app manifest that has the short name, icon, and start URL, and also the display. And we also register a service worker with a functional fetch handler, so it should be installable. And what is installable? Example indicators include an install button on the address bar at here for the desktop, and also there is a install bar at the bottom for the mobile phone. We open the Android simulator by using the Android Studio and go to the Tools AVD Managers and then we click on the Play buttons and in the previous lecture we already showed that we can use this IP address to get the local host of the computers. However, this is the local host of the computer, not the local host of the phone. So this will not pop up the installation bar. So we have to use the port forwarding in order to access the local host of the phone. So we need to go to the Google Chrome. We type Chrome inspect and then we can click on port forwarding. And for example, since our port is 5500, so we can type localhost 5500. And we also, for convenience, we use the same numbers and then click done. And then now we can go to here and type localhost 5500 and then click open. Now you can see it already start opening the website. And now as you can see, it already pop up the add my contact to the home screen. So when you click on this and click add, now you can see the icon already displayed inside the mobile phone.